We're nearing the end of 207X. I thought for the final segment in this class, we'd be here by the fire. In part because this is a nice image to think about our Paleolithic ancestors. Gathered around on some cold night, using the basic technology of fire, and even perhaps reminiscing about the things they've done that day. And that might seem like a very unexciting thing to talk about. And yet it reflects important changes that happened in our Pleistocene past. That ability to communicate, that ability to talk about events, talk about what you've gone through, and use those experiences, use those reminiscing of experiences to learn and move forward. This class has been an introduction. We've introduced you to the basics of how evolution works, basics of human and ape anatomy, how we study the fossil record, and then in fact the details of the human fossil record. The origins of bipedality, the transition to the Australopithecines, the origin of our genus, the genus Homo, and the ecological shift associated with larger brain size, larger body size, and the increasing complexity of human evolution as we move into the Pleistocene, as our brains get larger, as our social realities become more complex. And I really want this class to be an introduction to you in the broadest sense of the term. I don't want this to be the last course you take on human evolution. I want it to be the first. I want you to go leave this course and be more interested in those events that are going on at your local museum, a local institution. Uh, every opportunity you see where suddenly a topic from this class comes into your mind and you say, oh, this is a case where human evolution is important for how we understand the world today. That's my goal for this course. And that's, I hope, what you take with you from this course. And that knowledge not just of the basic outline of human evolution, how we as paleoanthropologists study human evolution, but how it matters for us today, and how we might see evidence of human evolution in the world around us today. So from me and from my family, I'd like to thank you for participating in these 12 weeks of 207X. I hope you've enjoyed it, I hope you've learned a lot, and I hope you come back for more in the future. So thank you.